going to show you how you can combine the Sabre Stim Pro and Sabre Glove. So if you're finding it's a bit difficult to open your hand, even with the Sabre Glove, you can add in a bit of extra electrical stimulation to help. So I'm just sticking the electrodes on, ready first. Turn the Stim Pro on got program one for the upper limb got it in channel a so I'm going to make a flash and then turn it up just so I can check before I put the glove on that I'm happy with where the electrodes are which I am so I'm then going to press pause by pressing the T button then put the glove on so fingers in first fine for the forearm strap to go across the electrode and then just tighten the hand strap up obviously you don't have to copy these tensioners it's however your Sabo glove is set up to work and the thumb one so now when I unpause it the stimulation comes on you can see the extra opening that it gives if i want to use that in a task rather than waiting for the timing then what i probably would rather do is use the trigger button so i can control exactly when the stim comes on so to do that make channel a flash and then press and hold the t button until a little triangle appears beneath the a and now when i press the t button the stimulation comes on when i let go it stops so from the side, press the T, comes on, when I stop it goes off. So if I want to practice a task such as picking up this apple, I wouldn't use any stimulation. I'd go forward, this is my own squeeze, and when I want to put the apple back down again, I'm going to try and open with the Sabre glove, but if I need a bit of extra help, I'll just press the T button to open my hand and then nothing's going to happen with the pro again. So I can pick the apple up when I want to let go. I'm going to try and work with the Sabo glove if it needs a bit of extra help and pressing the T to open up. 